what's going on guys? Um, in this box I have a fairly unique part that I'm excited to install on the GT. Um, I know I haven't made a video in a while so please bear with me guys. Uh, it's nearing the end of my senior year in high school so I've got to finish up a lot of stuff, um, a lot of projects and a paper. Um, so please bear with me there. I'm hoping this next week since I'm on spring break I can create a couple more videos for you guys to watch. Certainly at least two that I know for sure, so in addition to this one. So again, please bear with me and uh, I guess let's get on to this install. So I don't know if you guys can read that or not, but it says carbon fuel cover. And that's right, I have a kind of a homemade carbon fiber gas cover for my GT. Now it's a pretty big box for really how big the part is, so I guess they just want to be extra careful. But taking it out. That is what it looks like. Now I'll bring you guys in closer so you guys can take a better look at it, but um, it's not perfect. It is like a homemade type product. It's basically a carbon fiber weave laid over a uh, unpainted OEM part and then clear, clear coated. So, you know, it's not a molded carbon fiber, so it's not gonna have the weight reduction like you would normally have with a true carbon fiber part. Very excited to get this on the car and uh, I'll bring you guys in and give you a closer look. This is the carbon fiber part. Um, if you look close enough, you can see some imperfections in the uh, clear coat as well as some of the, uh, I guess, things on the outside like right here noticeably. There's a little dip in the edge of the clear coat. So I'm hoping that won't be a big deal once it's on the car, but I guess we'll find out. Um, I'm sure I can make that a little smoother by sanding it down and stuff like that, but I prefer not to do that. Um, you can see the weave in it. I believe this is called like a twill weave or something like that. The edges are not covered in the fiber, just the clear coat. And then the back is the unpainted part. Again, you can see it's a genuine part. Launcher GT 2013 Plus, and then JCraft is where I bought it. Believe it or not, this is an eBay part, so. Um, Got a good price for it and I'm excited to get it on the car. Now from what I've read online, the only thing you really need is a flathead screwdriver as I believe the Elantra GT is the only one that you can literally remove just the outside cover. <laughs> Where you can actually remove just the outside gas cover and not the whole arm and everything by itself. So um, I guess this is my first time doing it so please bear with me but let's go ahead and see if I can get it off with just a flathead screwdriver. All right, so let's try that again since my uh, memory card filled up. But um, I did figure it out. It's as simple as taking your flathead screwdriver, inserting it in this little tab, and prying backwards towards, uh, I guess, towards you or whatever. And pretty much just like that, it will uh, pop off. While you're at it, you might just want to give it a quick clean. So why not? And it's pretty much that easy. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed that quick little video on how to install the carbon fiber gas cover. Um, it's really super easy. Shouldn't take any more than a couple minutes. Um, even with no experience, it took me about two minutes to do. Uh, so yeah, I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please hit that like button. I'd greatly appreciate it. And uh, stay tuned for more videos this upcoming week, as again, I am on break. So hopefully I'll be able to get a couple more videos out for you guys since I've been kind of slacking. But uh, yeah, with that being said, I will see you guys in the next video.